Hi guys, we're here with UKMagicTricks.com reviewing another trick just for you. This is Rick. And this is Sam. And today we're reviewing Invisible by Damien Savina. Absolutely, bonjour to everybody. Um, so tell me a bit about the trick first of all. What, what, what's the actual effect? The effect is a floating, moving, in midair ring. And along with a couple other card variations, um, a vanish of the ring and bits and pieces like that. Um, so should we take a look at the trailer? Let's have a look. Yeah, that was the trailer punch. Yeah, that's good. Trailer punch. Okay, so that was the trailer. What do we think? Very, very visual. Extremely visual. Um, I've used ITR uh, a lot in the past. I haven't gotten along with it very, very well, to be honest. Have you ever seen anything like this on ITR? No, I haven't. And what got me was the push. Yep. The, the ring push. Um, and what I was really impressed with, when you push it, it's stable. That's it right. doesn't look like it's hanging from anything. No. Nope. It's, um, it makes you question if it is ITR, yeah, definitely. Yeah. Um, the movement as well, I would just like to point out, in the trailer you see the push, um, the movement we've worked out, yeah. so much more freedom than just that push. Yeah, yeah there is. Really you've got, um, when you when you kind of hold the ring, um, total control. You got you can move it uh, you know, around your hand like, you know, quite, quite freely yeah. with quite a good distance. You can actually even move it past your hand and past your palm mm. and past your fingers. And when you let go, stays. it just stays there. It really does. Yeah. Um, and there's no question about it. If you get the hookup correct, which is taught in great detail on Absolutely, the DVD. Yeah, very well, very well descriptive. And what's the nice thing about the hookup? It, it, it kind of gets, it, it kind of happens as a routine happens. That's right, yeah. Is that right? Yeah, so um, you have a couple of steps to follow, uh, but each step is a trick in itself. You know, it's very uh, so, like the that the, the ring goes from a, a vanish on top of your hands. That's right. Um, which then you end up throwing it uh, back up into your hand, yeah. which it looks, it looks incredible. Already hooked up for and, you to. Uh, yeah, and you 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 already once once that trick happens, you are then hooked up completely. That's right. For the the piece de resistance, yeah, if you want to call it that, to give back the ring. To give back the thin ring. Air. Thin the air. The spectator can take that ring. Yeah. <laughs> from your hand, which is floating in midair, that you just push slightly or move over to one, and they can just take it. That's right, and that's it, and they take it. It's insane. It is insane. What, does it sound too good to be true? Yeah. <laughs> it, it, it slightly, is. slightly, <laughs> slightly too good to be true, why? Um, the hookup itself is a uh, is quite complicated, isn't it? Yes, um, for, a, for an ITR, if you're not used to using ITR, this is not a beginner's effect. No, absolutely. Um, the you'll probably experience a lot of breakage uh, and resetting of the ITR yeah, yeah. itself. On a beginner to expert level, you know, where would you see it? We're going high, intermediate, low expert. I, I think. Yeah. Yeah, I would definitely say. You don't want to start out with this. No, it's um, a difficult. It's frustrating. Um, it will take a lot of uh, 
or practice at home? It's one of the things that for magicians that want to learn and want to nail something down and want to spend honestly months yeah. uh, of practice to get this performance ready then it's brilliant absolutely you know for one of these if you've worked with itr before it's, it, it's brilliant if you're one of these magicians that likes to open a box and just do an effect yeah you probably could to a degree absolutely yeah. but first you, couple steps yeah first couple steps you probably could but you would end up what breaking the uh breaking the reel yeah um you'd end up not achieving the effect that the dvd and damien silver savina savina sorry <laughs> damien savina wanted you to achieve that's right and it will not look as good as what you saw on the trailer so it's one of them things that's just going to take time patience but well worth it well worth it will yeah. it pay off it will pay off yeah i think it absolutely will pay off i mean i played around with it a lot at the beginning and i did break it a lot mm -hmm. uh but when it when i did pull it off you know i even played it to people like family and, and mm -hmm. people like that you know which you don't usually do with that sort of thing and Gobsmacked, gobsmacked, all the way, all the way through. Um, we're going to show a performance of you doing it now. Yeah, let's have a look. Um, yeah. And take a little look, see what you think, and then we'll come back and talk about what we just saw. Performance punch. Mm, no, no, performance. <laughs> 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 Ladies and gentlemen, this is real life magic. Would you like to take your ring, sir? Mm, why not? Why not? Lovely. It's take yours. my ring. It's my ring. That's his ring, and that's real magic. So that was the performance of Invisible. Uh, what I'm saying, by the way. Yours truly. Yeah. Yes. Um, from the perspective of the spectator, the reel is invisible, isn't it? It's extremely Absolutely. well made. The whole the whole piece of kit is extremely well made. It's if you look after it, it's going to last. Yeah. It really will. And the line that's on the reel, you can't, it's you can't see it. You can't see it. It's insane. You can get, you can have someone grilling <clears throat> your hands and burning. And we did with the camera. Yeah. And and I did with my eyes. I looked, and to try and see that, hmm. you've got to have some sort of laser Superman vision, vision laser yeah. vision. Oops. You know, you got to be Spider Man with spidey senses to actually right, see it. Yeah. That's not to say that's not to say you can defy normal ITR and go and wear block colours or anything yeah, like that. Yeah, and you, nice you don't always think about wearing. lighting conditions that's with right, where yeah. you are. Um, uh, I purposely we got a, a a ring flash on the camera at the moment, and I purposely didn't film the effect with the ring light on there because too much light on it. That's right. You, yeah. You're going to get glare on the thread, but you, yeah, you're going to do that with any invisible. Uh, sorry, any ITR. ITR yeah. Um, <laughs> you know, any IT, you, you're going to get it. Oh. So um, be cautious of lighting conditions. Dim lights and uh, not dim dim, but sort of moderate nighttime bar yeah, restaurant right, lighting yeah. is absolutely fine. Indoors, you you'll get away with it. Yeah, indoors you get away with it. You talk about block colours. What, what does That's that right. Mean? So um, effectively, Although it's black, probably can get away with it. Away with it in this shirt. The shirt I was wearing, the performance is a mix of black and greys, which is absolutely perfect for it because it stops your eye focusing on anything in between your shirt. So wear something with a pattern on it. Absolutely. Yeah. yeah. Wear avoid avoid blocks. Uh, avoid lo straight line like stripes. Mm -hmm. Um, that sort of thing. Yeah. I mean, you probably still get away with it. Yeah. You'd probably still get away with it, but yeah. um, just to make sure, probably just to make sure we yeah. get caught out. Just, just break up your, you know, your your IT with um, something that you're wearing. Yeah. Um, and yeah, as you say about focusing, if you've got something going on in your shirt, you're so, not going to focus in on something that you shouldn't no, see. Well, you can't. Yeah, yeah you, you can't, can't see yeah. it. So, so don't, just don't make it easy for anyone to uh, to make a focus point out of your clothing yeah um so let's get into our rating out of 10 yeah um personally i would give it an 8 out of 10 um i'm not going to perform it because i've been hindered by itr and being like kind of i don't know i've not got hatred for it but it, for me i i love just to go out and perform with just a deck of cards and no gimmicks no gaps no nothing um and that that's just me that's my performance that's what i do 
but the overall effect. But the overall effect, I'm giving it 8 out of 10 for the overall effect because it just is beautiful. And with the right work put into it and the right dedication to an effect like magicians should and used to, and mm. you know, and, and. It's definitely been a lot of time spent on it, you can tell. Yeah, can tell absolutely. That. And there's a lot of thought gone into how the, how the hookup works and how you're going to achieve the effect. And if you spend time doing it, you spend time practicing it, you're going to achieve great results. Honestly, That's great right. results. I will go for a 9 out of 10 because Ooh. the effect for me is is outstanding, you know. I think it's one of those things that um, you can you can close with and even if the thread does break at that closing point, you know, it doesn't it, matter. If it means landing something massive, you yeah. know, it's so so worth it. The effect is I, I actually seen the seen the trophy for the first time. I'm early on in magic myself, but seen it for the first time I actually questioned the use of an ITR anyway and you know, I've been doing magic for 10 years and I still questioned it as well to be honest I thought it could have been magnets or anything like that you know you, you actually do question it you have the ability to wave your hand completely over. above above uh, the ring above yeah. a, a borrowed ring could you can you can you go you can put your hands under it yeah you can put your hands under it and above it and above it and it's you're you're free yeah yeah the freedom with it is is outstanding. The only thing that the only thing that stops you, you know, the only thing that hinders it is is the hookup itself. It, but you know, then, despite how good it is, it does the, you the, can break it. You, you can know? break it, but you can break any IT anyway. And the nice thing again about the hookup, it hooks up through the routine. Yeah. So if you learn the full routine from start to finish, you're not going to have too much of a problem. You won't have a problem. Yeah. No. We've been here with UK Magic Tricks. Com. Thank you very much for watching. We'll see you very, very soon for another review with UK Magic Tricks. Oh, sorry, I got plug UK Magic Tricks yeah. again. Um, we reviewed Invisible. See you later. Peace out. Sam? Sam? I know the trick's called Invisible, but this is ridiculous. Sam? I'll do the same.